Yo, where are you? This is the summer wall. This is a picture of my granddad and I, taken two years before he disappeared in a plane crash. Here he is fishing in British Columbia, a year before his plane disappeared. George Kogar, that was his name. My granddad, that is. It's been almost 40 years since his plane disappeared, and he was an entrepreneur and an inventor. And some of the things he and his companies developed back in the 60s and 70s changed the direction of the computer industry as we know it today. So what I want to do is I want to take you to his personal shop. And I haven't been in it in 20 years, and it's been pretty much untouched. It's almost like a time capsule. So why don't you come along with me and let's see what cool things we can find. We're on our way now to the shop. It's about a 20 minute drive, um, mostly back roads. The shop itself sits on what used to be a 5,000 acre piece of property. first part of the shop there's just two bays here but down there is the part that still to this day <laughs> terrifies me uh, I have to walk all the way down that dark hallway in order to possibly get the lights turned on let's send the drone down there first in order to be able to see a little bit better with the drone what I did was I taped a uh, headlamp right onto the front Kale, my brother. All right, we gotta find the switch. Oh, that's my father's old snowmobile. Oh, and uh, what the hell took there? You're not turning those lights on. <laughs> I found one thing. <laughs> This guy, I remember is from being a little kid, it says, do not, I don't know what that says. I'll have to look later. So this is my grandfather's office right here. Holy crap. Absolutely destroyed. It's the logo for his, one of his companies, Permanent Images Incorporated. We call it a permanent image, and that's what it is. That if you don't break it, it will last forever. This is a totally new process of making images, where we're actually engraving the image into a material that is unaffected by anything that we know of in the atmosphere. That is to say, scientifically speaking, the image will not change uh, indefinitely. That means thousands of years it will look the same as it does today, even if it's put out of doors in full sunlight and exposed to all of the elements. This is a key from one of the computers that my grandfather developed called the Kogar 4. Let's see, it still presses. Okay, how is there nothing in there? I'm waiting for the dead right phone. That's... Yeah. Oh, there's a window here. Yeah, the oscilloscope. Yeah, it went right there. Looks good enough to me. This room that we're about to go in holds the dark room 
and a laboratory. Let's see. The stuff on the wall. Oh. <laughs> For the dark room. Oh my god. This is very creepy. Oh my god. Clearly, I was a raccoon in here, or some type of animal, because there is nothing but poop filling the drawers. Oh my God, even the carpet just skeets me out. Almost 40 years, there's stuff still sitting here. Old equipment. There's a very creepy, shiny wall over there that looks like it has something used to be on this as a kid this was the creepiest room so one thing we're not doing is going in the dark room <laughs> see there's still it's almost like it was left just the way it was you ready Kale? Kale where are you? all right uh, there's a, again, a lot of torn up stuff. Some raccoons have had a blast in here. This is actually one of his inventions over here. This thing right here. No, but the, he has a patent on this. These are two old wafer furnaces. You can see right in there. The wafers would go right into there to be baked. Yeah, supposed to, I was say, it supposed, worked. supposed to save that. Okay, that's the entire shop. Let's see what I found. Out of all the things I found, I think my favorite is this. This is a permanent image that you saw my grandfather speaking about earlier in the video. It's at least 40 years old. Now when this was first developed, there was no way of really knowing if it was gonna last forever. But it looks like he was right. Thousands of years, it will look the same as it does today, even if it's put out of doors in full sunlight and exposed to all of the elements. Mm -hmm. 